Welcome back to the channel. So I am just showing you all. So Excel has now launched or it has integrated Python into this platform. And so in order to enable it, you want to go into your accounts, Microsoft 365, and you want to enable the beta channel. And so that's what I'm showing you. You click agree and you, then you click OK. Now, a disclaimer, I'm not able to still access it. I don't know if there has been, you know, I know that they're still rolling this out. So I did post a question on the forum, uh, but essentially once you get access to the beta program, you are now supposed to see the insert Python when you look under formulas. So right now what I'm doing is I'm just double checking if I missed anything and I still do not see uh, Python. So I'm just going to type in Python here and I do see the insert Python. You see that there, but it should be within the formulas tab here, but for some reason it is not accessible to me and I've gone through all the steps. So I'm just going to take you on a preview of Python and Excel. Like I said, this may be rolled out. Maybe they're rolling it out um, in different stages. So essentially it's saying if you don't see the insert Python inside of under the formulas, you can to enable Python. All you have to do is click, uh, click on a cell and type equals P Y, and then that will enable Python as well. But you see, um, so I'm just looking at the direction. So it's just saying two ways. This is giving you ways to output the data. And so it's just saying, well done. It was a quick tour of, the new Python feature. So now I'm going to learn more. I want to show you guys here to get started with Python and Excel. Perhaps it will work for, for you all. It's telling you to join the Microsoft 365 program and then enable the beta channel. And then under formulas, you should see insert Python. If you do not see insert Python, you can still enable it by typing equals P Y. Again, the, this did not work for me. Uh, but I did email the forums and so I will keep you guys updated on that. But this is incredible. So now that we have this integration, Python integration in Excel, this will make data analysis, data modeling that much more streamlined, right? Um, now you see what I'm doing here. I'm just trying that. I'm letting you guys see. I'm typing in equals PY, still don't see it. It's supposed to pop up the, it's supposed to be like an auto pop up, but I still do not see it. So I'm coming back here to show you all the getting started with Python and Excel. So I'm just reading this instructions to see if I missed anything and it doesn't look like I missed anything because I did do all of these steps. Um, choose Pi from the auto complete menu. Um, and once Python is enabled in a cell, that cell displays a green Pi icon. I'm just going to try this one more time. So I'm going to try lowercase. I still do not see it. It should automatically pop up. It should automatically pop up. So it is not enabled for me. Now, once you have this Python, once you have Python installed, like I was saying, it should be under your formulas tab. And so you should see the insert Python. And this is a little quick tutorial. It's showing you how you can, it's telling you what is Python in Excel. And it's telling you that it brings the power of Python analytics into, into Excel. And so you can create data frames, you can create visualizations, images. Um, it's, this is telling you how to enable the Python in Excel preview, choosing the beta channel insider select formulas and select insert Python. And then in the dialog that appears, select the try preview. Well, I'm just digging into a little bit more information. Um, this is telling you how you can combine Python with Excel and the features and how this can basically super supercharge your data analytics. Uh, so I'll be really excited once this is available to me. Um, this is a little article here. Like I mentioned, it's just showing you, okay, what sets Python and Excel apart. It's built for analysts. And you see how easily we're able to, um, so we have our table here. 
category cells and then if we type equals pi we can highlight that create a data frame so it's creating a data frame and then we can create visualizations on that data frame within the cell uh, we could also do like i mentioned um, this has advanced visualizations seaborn matplotlib the same libraries that you access in python um, within pandas so this is just showing um, how you can extract and format format dates so this looks like a really powerful um, tool here that that they've included in excel so I'm, I'm super excited about this and so yeah i'm just scrolling this down here so tell me what you guys think